testimony, the man in the photo. I never saw anything. I don't mean, mind you. That morning, during the run-through of the action scene, I saw Powers trip and fall. He broke one of the props. It was a big mess. Apparently, he sprained his ankle pretty bad. Now look at that picture. You can see he's dragging his leg, see? Clear as day. That's how I knew it was Powers. Happy? Hmm, so he had a sprained ankle. Very well, Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. She's got to be hiding something. I'll press her until she squeals. Like, uh, don't read into that. <laughs> <laughs> no one was reading into that until you said it. No, everyone will do it. <laughs> hmm. Wimper snapper. Hey, I haven't said anything yet. <laughs> yeah. I'll have you know I'm not pointing fingers at anyone behind their backs. Everything I've said on this, uh, said that on. Uh, Lisa, they always worry about pointing fingers in your eyes or to make a, make a woman cry. Uh, Mr. Wright, please, for our sakes, try not to upset the witness. <laughs> Even Edgeworth can't take her! This is perfect! My goals! I think Edgeworth has met his match. He never had to deal with someone like this. Exactly. Who was present at the workroom? Yeah. Well, let's see. There was Powers, he's a steel samurai, then Coral Hammers, the evil magistrate, and me. Why is it. No one what else. And what exactly were you doing? Observing. Just observing. She was checking out Hammers. She was totally checking out Hammers. <laughs> what about the assistant? <laughs> oh, she was off moving backdrops around and such, so she didn't see the run through then. Hmm. Trip and fall. Yes, and to think he's supposed to be the steel samurai. What a laugh. <laughs> oh, ouch. So power sprained his ankle. She does not like powers. I know. I helped make it better for him, of course. You helped it make it better? I kissed it where it hurts. Oh. Uh, let's give over that part, <laughs> shall we? Where was the assistant then? Oh, her? She was just cleaning up backdrops, I think. She didn't know about Power's ankle. Hmm. You may continue your testimony. She's- he's just like, just get this whole away. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. Yeah, he broke one of the props. He broke the prop? Sure did. His own samurai spear. Oh! Samurai spear is a murder weapon? Luckily, I was there with my duct tape to fix it. This strike me as a significant detail. I better write this down in the courtroom. Updated. Wait, spring is making it pretty bad. I, I just need to look at it. Another weapon, a break in the shaft had been mended with duct tape. Okay. Oh, wrong one. I oh. think we've heard enough. Haven't we, Your Honor? Well, there's one thing that is bothers me. Which is? Where is this steel samurai costume now? Um, hmm. Actually, well, we couldn't find it. We're looking, though. Oh, so it was stolen. Hmm. Anyway, that's not important. The witness did see the Steel Samurai, yes. And it is clear that the person in the Steel Samurai suit was Mr. Will Powers. Hmm. I suppose that's right. Are you sure you're sure, Your Honor? Objection. I don't want to wait. Yeah. Oh, wait and see means guilty. Yeah. Hold it right there. We keep talking about possibilities. We have to, but we have to agree that this photo shows the steel samurai. Nowhere in this photo can we see Mr. Will Powers. Hmm. The defense has a point. I also wonder if someone else not caught on the camera could have killed Mr. Hammer. We have to consider that possibility also. See exactly. There's his face. He's yeah. like all smug. Then allow me to remove that doubt from your mind, Your Honor. Will the witness continue her testimony, please? No mm. need to ask twice. Oh my god. Witness's account continued. Okay. 
The time of poor Hammer's death was 2.30 p.m., true? The only person I saw go to the studio before then was Will Powers. No one else went there. If they had, I would have I would have seen them. Not if they'd come before one, you old bag. <laughs> true. You weren't there at one before any time before one. And the camera wasn't on before one either. It didn't capture anything during. It didn't capture so. anything until after she went back to the guard station. Right. Because hammers already went in, but it never captured hammers. Hmm. So if no one else went into the studio, then it would have to be the Steel Samurai who did it. Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna press it even though we don't really have to. Yeah. How do you know that? Eh? Didn't I just explain? I gave donuts to the young detective. And then after that, some rubbish about being a secret pal. He said, he told me everything. I see the two gunshot shared his fellow officer's fondness for donuts. I'm surprised our edge ref wasn't like. <sighs> yeah. Are you absolutely sure? Oh, quite, quite, Sunny. No, nobody suspicious looking passed by at all. Nobody suspicious looking? Right. No one else went in there. What about before you got to the car station? Gate is already closed, right? Before one? Why, everyone was in the employee area before then. And I locked the main gate so no one could get in. Not to mention... If they had, I would have seen them. Are you sure? The witness has answered the question. Anyone going in the studio had to pass by the witness. That's right, Sonny! You let him have an edgy boy. An edgy boy? <laughs> <laughs> Old Windbag sure has balls. Or, well, you know what I mean. Look at her face, she's like, oh, God. Uh, Old Windbags have a way to skipping over important details, after all. Or, uh, for that matter, entirely forgetting them. How, How convenient. convenient. That's not of any importance. The one you didn't see saw before. Jeff Cameron. Would we have evidence that Harley played question mark Jack Cameron? Or Will Hammer? Yet again, we keep saying, she kept saying everyone's there at the other studio, but how does she know that for sure if right. she didn't see them? I mean, it, from what I saw in the flashback, it was just the two actors, her and the assistant. Anyone else outside of those that group could have gone in. I have five tries. You have five Let's tries. Let's do this. The card key. Alright. Maybe. If they had, I would have seen them. Yep. If I had, I would have seen them. How would she have seen them? She's in the point round. I, I really just wanted to do the car key and be like, are you sure? <laughs> but I know it's not the car key. The right. car key is not the car the car key, not the car keys. <laughs> the car key. I, I have five tries to do it. It's not it, but I'm not fucking doing it. The witness thing is clearly faulty, Your Honor. I'm sorry, but can I, I see nothing faulty? Unfortunately, I have to penalize you, Mr. Wright. No one else went in there. Do we have 
not very proof. Yeah. That, that maybe no one else that maybe someone else went in there. I mean, okay, I st I'm just like going back to the card key because I'm like, if we took a card key, someone else could have, you know? Mm -hmm. But my brother said to look at the picture very carefully. He said to look at the pictures very carefully. It doesn't look like two person in a costume. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first thing I have to look at. Um, it doesn't seem like there's anyone else in the photo. October 15th. Taken at 2 p.m. Photo number two. I'm, is there something else in the back? We didn't show it. You're like, oh, there's something on the back, and we never saw it. I'm like, That's it's the like date. how we. That's never... the date. It's the date. No, they said something else was printed in the back, but it was the. And then they look at Peter. They're like, That's the only data on it. They didn't say it was the date. They just said there was something else printed on the back. Which, unless I see it, I. Don't think it's a date. They had, I would have seen them. I'm just saying, before one o'clock. That's what faulty about it. Cause you don't know if anyone was in there before one o'clock. I'm gonna I'm gonna press on. Oh wait, this is the other one, I forgot, it moves on to the next one. Her face, I like how she's here, is she like, I don't know, who can you stand with, or whatever. I mean, the only thing I can, like, object to is her, when I press her, but it's not changed to the statement. So. Oops. Freaking, keep forgetting where's the mm -hmm. last one. I wish, I wish they put a thingy for the last one, but they don't. I'm still saying her testimony is faulty because she wasn't there until 1 o'clock. Yeah, I would have seen them. Do we have any evidence that might show that maybe someone else came in before one hours? Do we? We have this photo, but it's 2 p.m. Car key, which doesn't show anyone at all. The map, which doesn't show anything at all. Before powers. I mean, the only thing is this photo, which it's question mark, question mark, question mark. If it's it's powers. Then look at the, look at the description. He's dragging one big leg. Check October fifteenth. Wait, October what day is it? October fifteenth. Okay, photo number two. It, that number two is, yeah, I guess. I have nothing to lose, whatever. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Hold on. Look at this photograph one more time. 
This photo was taken by the camera at the gate of, for the studio, correct? There it is, okay. Yes, sir, yes, sir. So whenever anyone passes by here, it automatically takes a picture? And here I thought you didn't know your head from a hole in the ground. Right, anyway. It's also true that a computer in the guard station record all security cam data. Oh, you know, if you wanted to work at the studio, we might have an opening. That very computer printed out this photo. Note that on the back of the photo are printed the words October... Oh, it is the date. Mm -hmm. October 15, 2 p.m., photo number 2. Even I know what that means. It was taken at 2 p.m. on October the 15th. Really, Sunny. Actually, I knew that too. The issue here is the bit at the end that says, Photo number 2. Photo number 2? The computer only held data from one photo on that day. Don't you think that's odd? Shouldn't this photo be photo number one if it really was the only photo? Hello. Order, order. 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 Please tell the court what this mean by what you mean by this, Mr. Wright. Actually, that's what I want to ask the witness. This evidence shows that not one but two people went to the studio that day. Yet there is only one data for one of the photo. Who could have erased the data for the other photo? Only someone with access. The security lady herself. Why you? Watch your mouth, you whipper snapper. The only person I saw that day was Will Powers. But the camera on the gate fired twice. That means two people went by. Uh, well, yes, that's what it would seem to me. Can the witness explain this to the court? Um, <laughs> I, I don't understand these newfangled computer things. Um, edgy boy, help. <laughs> but believe me, I want to. But this, I don't know what this means either. Hm, some help you are. You're a whippersnapper too. Whippersnapper? Huh, something to matter, old Mrs. Old Bag? Ah, that's right. I, I just remembered something. Let me guess. Someone else passed by the gate? Someone other than the Steel Samurai? Er, well, yes, I suppose you could put it like that. Put it, that way. put it that way. I see. Your testimony, please. Okay. The other person. Every day after I finish my guard duties, I have one other important job to do. I go through the photos recorded on the security computer and check them out. I throw out any photos that aren't suspicious looking, you see? Come to think of it, now I remember throwing out one photo that day. Really? <laughs> M Mrs. Oldbag, this is the first I've I've heard of this. Well, of course, Sonny. I've only just remembered it. Can we really trust our testimony? Right. Anyway, uh, Mr. Wright, please examine. Uh, please begin your cross examination. Well, I'd say this was a turn pretty unexpected. I kind of expected this. Her expression. She's yeah, like, I'm exactly. So done. It's like, uh. Can I go now? Yeah. So, what's up with that thrown out photo? Another job. If that's right. I checked out the people that passed by the main gate that day. I look closely at every one of the photos that the security camera takes. You back up all the security camera data? Hang on. Well, they keep telling me to, yes. But those computers are just so frustrating. Oh, dear God. <laughs> yeah. I throw any photos that aren't suspicious looking. Okay, now the question is, did you clear the recycle bin? <laughs> yeah, probably. I don't know. She, she can't figure out how to back it up. Can she figure out how to delete, actually delete. Delete, delete? Yeah. Because if not, they're just piling up in the recycle bin. Which isn't saving much, yeah. I mean, if it's there, then we can still get access to that photo. Correct. But if it's not, then... Let's say we can... Maybe hack into it and get it. I don't know. I don't remember, like... I remember, like... I remember hearing something, like... If you delete it, there might be a way to, like... 
restore it. Like right. delete it, delete it. Remind me to destroy it, but you have to hack into like the thing to get it back or something mm -hmm. like that. But I'm not sure if it's true or not. I don't remember reading something about it. How do you, how exactly do you determine what isn't suspicious looking? Oh yes, you can tell by looking at their faces for the most part. Oh dear God. <laughs> well, for the most part. This, this is, is a, a murder, murder trial, Miss Oh Oh my gosh. Well, I didn't touch that suspicious looking Will Powers photo, did I? Yeah. I, I think she's missing the point. Yeah. Come to think of it now, I don't remember throwing out one photo that day. Well, who the heck was that in that photo you erased? A fanboy. A fanboy? Steel Samurai fanboys. Real freaks, if you ask me. Oh. They get information out of the rehearsals from gosh knows where. They're always hanging about. One was there that day. <laughs> Wait a second. Didn't you say no one else could get in? Ah. I locked the main gate so no one could get in. Those were your words. Well, if you must know, there's a drain that goes into the employee area. The grate has been loose for a while. It leads outside, and well, that's how they can come in. That's where they come in. They come in through the drain? I told you they were freaks. Oh, and... And? They're kids. Children. Whippersnappers. Kids? So on the photo that you erase... It was a boy. Probably second or third grade. What? <laughs> uh, order! Order! See, I knew it someone else came in, a kid. Let me get this straight. You saw two people pass by the gate on their way to the studios that day? One was the Steel Samurai dragging his leg. The other was a boy who looked like about third, second or third grade? Oh yes. Well, you see, we see his type there every day. We can't stop him. Can't catch him. A boy in second or third grade. Mm. I assume it would be hard, to, if not impossible, for a young boy to wield the samurai spear. Impossible, I think. It's quite heavy. Right. And I, as I said, I didn't pay him much mind. Interesting how he, she doesn't pay him much mind, even though he's just a kid. Right. But Arbery, because. Everyone else, they're like small children coming in, they're like, can't do anything about it. Mm -hmm. But I guess, but still. That's right, I erased the data. Okay. This security camera lady, this security lady is just bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Why did you re erase the data? They keep telling her to back it up, but she just straight up deleted it. Yeah. Um, um Nick, what's going yeah. on? I mean, the boy was there, that makes him a suspect. Yeah. yeah, and they're already trying to unsuspect him. I'd like to take a five minute recess. I too. I want the defense and the prosecution to consider this new information. There, okay, yet again, the boy could not, a second to third grade boy, would not be able to overpower a hammer. Mm -hmm. He, probably not the murderer, mm -hmm. but could testify, maybe seeing who else could have been in as well. Correct. Say anyone who came in for, say, one. Or say they took off the mask. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. And no forgetting vital information this time. Don't trust anything, she says. She's going to forget everything. How do we trust her? How do we trust her? October 18th. 11.08 a.m. District Court Defense Lobby, number three. Mr. Is WP! Y yes Tell me straight, were you really in your dressing room? You didn't go to the studio? I... I didn't go to the studio. I was sleeping. Honest. What was this about sleeping pills? So, who was the steel samurai in that security photo? H how should I know? The Steel Samurai costume was off in the corner of the dressing room. Anyone could have walked in and taken it, really. What? You should take better care of that stuff. I couldn't imagine anyone who would want to steal a Steel Samurai costume. Fanboys, that's who. So, <laughs> where does this leave me? It doesn't look good. 
You're the only lightly suspect right now. Nick, what are we gonna do? First, we pay for more time. We'll start targeting someone else that could conveniently have done this. Conceivably. Right. Oh, right. And it'll take them so long to shoot us down that we get another day. Right. But if we pick up the wrong person, we might lose on the spot. You don't sound very optimistic. I'm not optimistic at all, actually. <laughs> hey, Nick, it's time. Okay, let's go. What does that mean? Please don't sigh like that. Alright, guys. In the next episode, we'll be finishing up this day in court. Possibly going back to the scene of the crime if we uh, are able to get one more day in this court case. Possibly trying to find that child who could have seen something else. Exactly. See you guys then. Bye.